welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle today I'm going to be doing the latest travel news worldwide part two and more so let's jump right into it now if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe it's a red and white subscribe mod button also click the notification bell and it uploads every video that I upload and um, the second I upload it and I upload at least three times a week and um, but recently um, over the past three weeks I've been uploading five times a week um, on uh, both my travel and lifestyle channel so let's jump right into it now according to breakingtravelnews.com I've got seven fabulous facts and coming up later is um, a subscriber's uh, question um, that he gave to me online so I've re replied back to him online but I'm going to tell you about the questions because I think um, that um, everybody or at least who is uh, travelling by BA or looking to travel by Eurostar should know but we'll get into that later and uh, just um, other tips as well later on in the video um, that I'm going to give to you um, but according to breakingtravelnews.com these are the latest news worldwide and we'll fire away with number one which is Saudi Arabia seems sees a growth in domestic tourism through partnerships with 90 tourism businesses including hotels tour operators and destination management companies uh, the Saudi, uh, Saudi tourism authority he developed a hundred tourism offers and packages so well done to Saudi Arabia for that that's amazing well done to Saudi Arabia tourism and I really hope um, that Saudi Arabia continues to receive growth in uh, tourism it'll be very exciting um, for a country that's only this past couple of years um, has um, been made uh, made it legal uh, for you um, to go and as a tourist to see the country uh, which is absolutely fantastic news uh, well done to Saudi Arabia on that yay that's some real good news also Lithuania uh, Lith Lufthansa Group, excuse my pronunciation, <laughs> um, waives all rebooking fees until 2021. So, yay, well done for the German airline Lufthansa for that. And um, I really hope um, that uh, people start booking. Um, Re and rebooking holidays with the airline and number three Emirates is to add two new African destinations to the schedule they are Connery in Guinea which is the capital of Guinea and the Duca the capital of Senegal so well done Emirates and Guinea and Senegal for that and so Emirates can enjoy um, or the people travelling with Emirates 
either getting connections or going from Dubai in the Emirates to uh, these countries in Africa that's again excellent news well done really exciting and uh, number four unfortunately princesses uh, cruises um cancels early uh, 2021 departures the cruise line has cancelled uh world and circle south america cruises it has um blamed the limitations and the restrictions um again it is hard for harder for cruises because they probably have to have more um social distancing and safety measures and again it's just the the limitations um as well um so it's probably again best all round then people to book and again and um, not be safe while on the cruises now number five american airways unfortunately is impending job losses as care carers act expires in October, it is to cut as many nineteen, as many as nineteen thousand jobs. Unfortunately, so my heart breaks, and it's just a terrible loss. Um, but I hope American Airlines in the future can get its tourism back up. And number six, WTTC. Um, call for COVID-19 testing program as tourism losses mount as 22 billion it looks to be set to loss to be in a loss um, with the UK economy uh, due to um, approved international travel joint 2020 um, according to the World Travel and Tourism Council so um, again I do agree um, you do need to get a a COVID-19 testing program to make sure people that are traveling are safe and um, again um, and do something about it and so it's not spreading to other people and you know other countries etc number seven southwestern railway unveils new air fleet that's really good news and um, new one billion fleet is set to transform across west london to sorry to berkshire in the uk so wow i really hope that goes as well as possible it looks absolutely fantastic the train um now going on um, to one of my subscribers, recent subscribers, uh, Michael Rex, um, has asked, um, are Euro Star trains still going at the minute? I went onto their website and found um, that uh, they are st uh, still running, but you will, with going to Europe, have to have a, an updated COVID-19 test um, because again you're going to Europe and you may have to quarantine um, for 14 days when you uh, come back um, so yes but the, they are running the trains uh, for, from London to Europe um, National Express, um, where I used to work, coaches are still running um, in the UK. 
also uh, Michael Rax um, asked will BA increase the prices and what are my thoughts I said um, if that is an increase and um, it may be due to fuel price increase or um, having to pay out for more precautions and um, to fall in line with the government guidelines and um, so those are the reasons in my opinion if there are price increases in the future um, again another tip i'm going to give you if you're booking a holiday or day trips uh, where you have to book in advance and um, i would always uh, pay by a uh, credit card so uh, you can get a refund um if you say have to cancel or anything goes wrong uh, they have to to cancel and i would also make sure that you it, it, your tickets are refundable when you book um really um again it just makes it easier for you uh, being able to claim a refund uh, than a holiday or um say um a day trip that can't be refunded also you can look out for um online offers and um basically coupons where you can get discounts and um, also consider places that you can go for free uh, with your family that um, you may only have to pay parking or not an entrance fee or just a do consider places where you just have to give a donation uh, while you're there and um, they also could be again the best way to get round it as well because you're not actually paying anything out so thank you for watching please like and subscribe if you haven't already done so and i'll see you in my next travel video which is um going to be tomorrow it's going to be the latest uh, travel news worldwide part three so thank you for watching love you all you all mean the world to me subscribers and viewers and bye for now thank you bye